The truth about Rico Blanco. Rico Rene Granados Blanco, born March 17, 1973, is a Filipino singer, songwriter, multi-instrumentalist, record producer, actor, endorser and entrepreneur. He began his career as one of the founding members, and served as the chief songwriter, vocalist, guitarist, and keyboardist of the Filipino rock band River Maya from 1994 until 2007, and has been a solo artist since 2008. Blanco's songs and performances gained success and critical acclaim, earning himself a reputation of being one of the well-received local music icons in the Philippines. Early Life Rico Blanco was born at Manila Doctors Hospital in Armida, Manila on March 17, 1973, to Rene Aldeguer Blanco of Aloyolo City and Purita Crisostomo Granados of Late, Late. Blanco grew up in San Pedro, Laguna Blanco graduated in the Ateneo de Manila University with a degree of AB in Management Economics where he was once a classmate of Chris Aquino. He is currently in a relationship with Maris Reckle. Early career, Rico was one of the founding members of the Filipino rock band River Maya, in varying roles as vocalist, keyboardist, guitarist, and main songwriter from 1994 to 2007. Rico Blanco is also a stage, film, and television actor. He starred in ABS-CBN's Immortal alongside John Lloyd Cruz and Angel Loxon, and Mia Sang Pangarap alongside Carmina Villarreal and Vina Morales. He also starred alongside Noel Cabungan and Joey Ayala in the Music Museum and 1970s Bistro production of Jesus Christ Superstar and also starred alongside Epi Crison and Christopher De Leon in the independent film Nason C. Francis. He also directed several music videos, won an award for his work as advertising musical arranger. Blanco also dabbles in painting and photography. Among the albums Blanco produced are Slapshock's Project 11 to 41, Cigar Free Sawakas, The Dawn Salamat, Millennium Edition single, Tease I Was a Teenage Tree and River Maya's free album which won him an NU Rock Award for Producer of the Year. Blanco also used to host MYX Live. He also composed and arranged scores for many commercials and other various corporate functions around the Philippines. In May 2007, Blanco announced his departure from River Maya. His last performance with River Maya was on May 4, 2007, at the Metro Bar, where in two other high-profile Filipino bands opened the show, Pupil and Sandwich. Two spin-off bands of the legendary pop rock group Eraserheads. It was coincidental that Rico's first gig as singer for River Maya was also held at the Metro Bar, formerly known as Campo. Furthermore, first ever River Mile gig, where Blanco was keyboardist, was in Las Pinas in 1993 where the band was the opening act for Eraserheads. In 2007, he launched a clothing line for a clothing brand in the Philippines, Human. Blanco also wrote and produced an electronic dance music song titled Control for the album of Nancy Costiglione. In the same year, Rico Blanco was also cast as the voice actor of Ryusuke Minami, lead guitarist of the fictional band, Beck, in the Filipino dubbed edition of the anime series Beck, Mongolian Chop Squad. Solo artist, on June 12, 2008, Warner Music Philippines, launched Rico Blanco's first single Yuto which marked his entry in the Filipino music industry as a solo artist. Critics and music fans immediately hail it as a neo-epic. The song won a host of awards, among them four major I Eat awards including Song of the Year. His first album titled Your Universe was released on August 8, 2008. The 10-track CD is a unique fusion of diverse sounds, among them the ethno rock Yurto, the hard-tugging title track Your Universe, the rockabilly punk feel of Aoyas, the sweet, pinery folk para Hindi Kamala, and the sing-along anthem Antukan. Also notable is his return to his roots as a keyboard player as evidenced by the infusion of synthesizer and electronic elements throughout the album. Incidentally, Warner Music Philippines are known for disbanding bands and turning their respective lead vocalists into solo artists. Rico's live band was usually composed of Robert De La Cruz, of Queso and Sco Church, on drums and Richie Garango, formerly of Hungry Young Poets and Mojafly, on bass, while Rico plays guitars and keyboards. Many other session musicians join him on stage from time to time. In November 2008, Blanco won the Vocalist of the Year Award in the NU Rock Awards. In December 2008, he was heralded RX 93.10 PM Solo Artist of the Year. He also opened for Mike's Missouri, 2008 and performed Yurto. Aside from his band, the Mandalayan Children's Choir, Manila Symphony Orchestra, Kulintangan Musicians, headed by Malu Machut, and various percussionists, headed by Aguida Dios, all performed with him. The opening set was touted to be the biggest in the event's history. In February 2009, he won as Best New Artist in the MYX Music Awards 2009. 
Then, Blanco was picked by Unilever Philippines to rewrite and sing a version of the regional campaign song of Close Up Toothpaste, released a single entitled Come Closer. In December 2009, Blanco launched his new music video for the single Ahas. It features his dance tribute to Gene Kelly and Fred Astaire, with Christine Reyes as special guest. In May 2010, Blanco was announced to be on the cast of ABS-CBN's supernatural political thriller TV series Immortal which stars John Lloyd Cruz and Angel Loxon. Blanco also sang the song Cat while on Sabahin for the said TV series. This was followed by the launch of Rico Blanco's very own company, Balcony Entertainment, in cooperation with Warner Music Philippines. The same year, Rico Blanco launched his first album Your Universe in other Asian countries such as Singapore and Hong Kong. The Asian release featured a new single Neon Lights, the song quickly gained the number one spot on Hong Kong charts beating other artists such as Justin Bieber, Avril Lavigne, Wonder Girls and Mika. In the same year, Blanco co-wrote the song Chemistry with Celine Hussaf for the latter's self-titled debut album. In 2012, Blanco released a new single, Amits, available for digital download via iTunes. The single was taken from his second studio album Galactic Fiesta Medic released on July 10, 2012. On November 27, 2015, Blanco released his third album Dating Gary. On January 9, 2016, he reunited with his former River Maya co-members, Perf De Castro, Nathan Azarkin and Mark Esqueda for a secret mini-semi reunion, following De Castro's gig at 19 East, Togwig City. His single Wag Mong Aminen was the number one song for 2016 in Magic 89.9's OPM chart. Charity and social activism, Blanco was a founding Sangamiang Kabatan chairman in his hometown of San Pedro, Laguna long before he started his music career. Aside from his songwriter credits in the solo album and in River Maya, Blanco also arranged and wrote music for various cause-oriented projects such as the United Nations Millennium Development Goals themed Teo Teo Rin, the Philippine Department of Tourism themed Vieja Teo, both of which were performed by veteran Filipino musicians, such as Freddie Aguilar, the APO Hiking Society, Lisa Longa, and Sharon Cuneta. He also co-wrote Posable, which has been used as a theme song for the 2005 Southeast Asian Games. During his hiatus from music in 2007, Blanco spent his time with philanthropic work. In late 2007 he came out of retirement to sing for the Sumalai farmers who walked 1,700 kilometers from Bukidnon to reach Department of Agrarian Reform in Metro Manila. Rico sang together with Imago vocalist Aya de Leon, and sandwich frontman Raymond Marasigan, on Akoang Simula, the theme song for a campaign which calls on Filipinos, especially the youth, to actively participate in the 2010 elections. When super typhoons ravaged the Philippines in September 2009, Rico responded quickly by writing and recording and releasing Bangan, to raise awareness and ultimately, funds to help the victims of the typhoons. Rico gave away the song as a free download to give hope to the victims, salute the heroes and inspire people to continue helping. Blanco also said that he is waiving all royalties due to him for the mobile downloads of the song, which he will instead give to affected families. In March 2011, Sesame Street Philippines went into partnership with Blanco to launch the new education campaign called Sesame Street Kid Ako. The campaign will launch in schools which will use Sesame Street books and videos to help encourage learning among kids at an early age. Blanco is also set to make two songs for the campaign. When Typhoon Haiyan devastated his mother's home province, Blanco decided to spend the New Year holidays in a still reeling and electricity less late and perform in as many evacuation centers as possible to comfort the survivors and help educate them about the importance of hygiene and preventing the spread of post-calamity diseases. A few weeks prior, just after the typhoon struck, Blanco nearly cancelled his appearance at the Sundown Music Festival in Singapore, but decided to forge on and dedicated his performance and talent fees to the people of late. He currently serves as the president of the Filipino Society of Composers, Authors and Publishers, Philscap, a non-profit, non-government, collective management organization that champions intellectual property rights. Musical influences, at a young age, Rico listened heavily to his uncle's records which included the Beatles, jazz and 1970s rock. He moved on to appreciate late 1970s to 1980s punk rock, post-punk, synth-pop and new wave artists, mostly from the UK such as XTC, The Cure, The Smiths, U2, Echo and The Bunnymen, The Sex Pistols, The Clash, Depeche Mode, Kraftwerk, OMD, Tears for Fears, Ultravox, New Order, Madness, Terry Hall, Syxy and the Banshees, Midnight Oil, Owls, among others. He also listened to Filipino artists such as Dean's December, Violent Playground, Identity Crisis, Urban Bandits, Joey Ayala, among others. The music he listened to while growing up is largely credited for his musical style. 
endorsements and business interest. Throughout his career, Rico Blanco has partnered with some of the biggest brands in the Philippines for their advertising campaigns. Blanco was a partner in Capone's Makati, and Alphonse Bistro Vault in Pasig. He is currently a partner in Time in Manila in Makati and the brewery at the Palace in Tawig. In 2010, Rico Blanco established Loudbox, an audio production post studio mainly catering to the advertising industry. His business partners are Manuel Lagarda of Wolfgang, Zach Castillo, Alan Feliciano, and Edsel Tolentino. Also on the same year, following his endorsement in human clothing brand, Rico launched his own brand named Coboy, located at San Juan City, Metro Manila. In 2014, Rico Blanco was introduced as the newest brand ambassador of Giordano Philippines. Awards, as individual slash solo artist, year, 2008 and you rock awards vocalist of the year and A1, guitarist of the year and A nominated, artist of the year and A nominated, producer of the year year universe nominated, RX 93.1 FM OPM solo artist of the year and A1, 2009 IED awards best performance by a male recording artist year till one, song of the year one, best musical arrangement one, best engineered recording and G Rosal for year till one, MYX music awards favorite new artist and A1, and you rock awards song, of the year and took in one philippine radio music awards album of the year year universe one best solo artist na1 best new artist na1 2010 mix music awards favorite mike's live performance na1 2014 mix music awards favorite collaboration with glock 9 for magla one 2017 mix music awards favorite rock video video queen one 